Hi guys, it's Trish from Trish's Card Club, live from Chattanooga. I am not ready. Time has gotten away from me, and I'm not even on Facebook yet. So I don't know if anybody's out there. Hopefully somebody will come join us soon. I think my camera is kind of cattywampus. Oh well, it's all good. It's all good. Happy Monday night. How are you guys? I am a little hoarse, as you probably can tell by my throat, because allergies here are crazy, 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 crazy. Okay, now I've got a, I've got a, I'm, I'm up on camera, and I'm ready to get started. And we're going to be using the mini tonight. I love this mini; it's so cute. So the card I'm making tonight is actually inspired by someone whose name I didn't write down, but I will go back and post it after. Um, so you, she can get full credit for the card. Um, we're using a set of dies that is so pretty. And it's on clearance for a half off. And they're worth every penny of it. It comes with a stamp set, but you don't need the stamp set. The dies speak completely for themselves. Um, the stamp set, although I'm not 100% sure it's still available. Because remember it says supplies last. This is the stamp set right here. And then this is the dies. But you can see you don't need this. I mean, you could use the words. They're really nice. But you don't need the stamp set per se because all the dies are fantastic. So that's the, that's the dies that we're using. And first thing we're going to do is set up our little mini. I, no, I, I know I sound bad, Karen, but I sound worse than I am. Uh, you know how when you, you get all... Um, uh, post nasal drip so it's just all down in my throat unfortunately hey you guys thanks for joining huckles and mary and anna good to see you guys miss cindy good to see you too miss karen you can go ahead and send the check for your paper share uh whenever you want because i'm ready to place the order and anybody else um that is interested i i actually have now two openings if someone wants to do a paper share um if you've already committed and you haven't sent your money in i know some of you already have um go ahead and get the check to me or zell uh, or ven venmo me um, I don't need a break. I know my voice sounds awful, but really I am okay. <laughs> I had a lot of voice rest this weekend. So, okay. So let's get going on this card. The card is a little bit sad in terms of what we're making because I'm making this for my sister-in-law whose mom passed away. And so that it's a little hard, um, for her. Her mom was sick. Um, she passed away peacefully. She had and I don't, Amber, you can correct me. I don't know if she had Alzheimer's or she just had dementia, but she was um, pretty sick for a long time in a in a nursing home. So Karen, um, Karen Brevard, it's 54 with um, shipping. Hey, Huckles, it's good to see you on. Hopefully you'll, you'll be able to stay on. Okay, now let's see. Do I need to get this up a little bit so you can see more? Um, I don't think this is the die that I wanted to use. Because I don't remember having a heart. Oh, you know what? It's not. <laughs> These are the dies I want to use. Let me start that again. Hopefully I can get four flowers out of here. It's I could have used that flower, but... Okay, so... Oh, and I think I've got it off the edge. How did that one come out? Eh, it's going to work. It's going to work. All right, let's do this one. This little mini is so convenient. Alzheimer's. Thanks, Anna. Yes, my sister-in-law's mom passed away from Alzheimer's, my, my, as my mom did. And it's no matter how old we are, when we lose our mom, it's hard. It's always very, very hard. And Judy was the only girl with um, a couple of brothers, so a lot of the care fell on her. So uh, these are just, you know, you just want to send someone a card and let them know that you're thinking about them, praying for them. So that's what this card's going to be tonight. So we're going to do four flowers. And then one more. I can't tell if you can hear my husband. He's still working. He's talking to one of his colleagues. That boy puts in some long, long hours. Okay. Whoops. It moved. And it's going to cut off the edge again. Let's try to get that on there. Okay, that's that. Four flowers are done. They're right there. And then I need to do 
some black for the inside flowers. And those come in twos, so it makes it a little quicker. So how have you guys been? Oh, I'm probably wiggling the camera all over the place. If I am, I apologize. That's the one drawback of um, doing the cut and emboss machine. When you're live, it shakes the table pretty bad. So I forgot about that. So if you're getting a little dizzy or seasick, I apologize. I'm almost done. I just have one more thing to cut, and then we can assemble. When they saw this card... Of course, I fell in love with it because it's black and white with a cut touch of color. And if you guys know me, you know that's something that I love. Um, but I didn't really think of it at first as a as a sympathy card. But then as the more I looked at it, the more I thought, you know what? It actually is a beautiful sympathy card because it's beautiful flowers. And I know that my sister-in-law will remember the good years of her mom's life. And this card will celebrate that. And so this is going to end up working out perfect for us. <clears throat> a sympathy card. Okay. Now, my white card base. And this paper is from the DSP that was the Hostess set. So that's what we're using for that. We'll get some glued on. Do one. and then I'm missing a strip oh hmm I'm missing a strip of paper one moment please sorry guys it must have fallen out When I moved everything from where my stamping stuff is to over here at the dining table, it fell out. So let's, <clears throat> let's see where I want to put that. <coughs> Sorry. You know what it is? It's just that my throat gets dry. So when I talk, it sounds worse than it really is. Okay, now we're going to trim that piece off. Like that. Now, let's see. I don't really like how that came out, but let me see if I can make it a little rounder. That'll work. That will work. <clears throat> I actually need my bigger dimensionals, but... I'm going to do, I'm going to work with this. I might go back after I do the class and put my, hey, Miss Brenda. <laughs> and it's a mini shaking. Yeah, it is a mini. It is. I might go back and put more dimensionals on after. So we haven't done a card making for a little while where I've done everything on screen. So this makes me feel good that we're doing it all on screen tonight. Isn't that pretty? And I will, oh, excuse me, like I said, I'll go back and I'll, I'll give credit to the person that I saw the card online so that she gets credit because it's her work. And she was generous enough to share it, so I like to give him credit for it. Well, spring has sprung here for sure. The pollen is everywhere. Our cars that are white are yellow every day when we go outside. Because I haven't really felt good, I haven't walked in a couple days. So, um, but the, as I drive past the trees, they're they're in really in full bloom. They have quite a few leaves on them. They're very very pretty. Gives me hope that summer weather is coming. Though everyone says don't complain because um, it's going to get hot. I chuckle. If there's one thing I'm used to in my life. After living in Florida for 20-something years, this, I'm used to hot, for sure. All right. So there's the card. Now, obviously, it doesn't have to be a sympathy card. It can be any kind of card you want. I just thought it looked... It's it's 
it just invokes in me the thought of caring. So that's why I chose to use the sympathy card. The stamp set that I'm using is Special Moments. It was a photopolymer stamp set that you could get um, during cele the celebration we just had. So I bring that up because there's going to be another celebration coming up in July and August, I believe. So save your pennies for that. This one's not available, but it's a good stamp set to have with all the different things on it. So where are you guys at with catalogs? Hey, Sheila. Yeah, allergies. Really bad. Yeah. Thanks for joining. It's good to see you. Um, oh, I know, Cindy. Black and white's my favorite color combo, for sure. For sure. And then there's With Sympathy. And I think that will be a card that will really bless my sister-in-law, my brother, and her kids. They're, they're all adults. Her kids are all adults. But still, it's always hard to lose your Grammy. So that's the card for tonight, you guys. Um, I hope I didn't miss anybody. Um, just one more plug out there. Oh, that's nice. No, Aunt, my sister's telling me that Judy's mom loved gardening, so the flowers will be a nice touch. I didn't even know that, so that's really good. That's really good. Good. Um, just another little quick thing, you guys. I have two openings for um, paper share if anybody's interested. It's $55. That includes the paper and shipping. And I have to know in the next couple days because I'm placing the order May 3rd. If you've already committed, if you want to send the check my way, that would be fantastic. Um, thanks for the good, the, um, um, compliments you guys. All right. So around here we make it and we mail it. So this is one we made tonight and I'm going to mail it and get it, get out in the mail. And I've gotten, um, a, a four RSVPs for my class here at the clubhouse. So I'm excited. I'll send one more email reminder out and see if any of the other people that had said they were interested can make it. I know one, one couple told me they might have a conflict of schedule, so they might not be able to make this one, but they'll be able to come for the, to the month after, uh, in June. So I'm excited. So, um, <clears throat> I think that's it. You guys, I'm going to rest my voice. I miss you guys. I love you guys. And, um, that's it. Just make it, mail it, and have a really good week. We'll talk to you next week. Bye-bye.